Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Vidula. So this um, topic is about dogs. So are you a dog lover? Are you a pet lover? And are you looking for someone to help you to train your dog? This is the right video for you. So please keep watching. So I'm going to introduce you uh, to Ivan. Uh, Mr. Ivan used to run a music school um, and uh, after that he gave, gave it away. He sold the school and then he came and joined the company where I was working. Uh, so we used to be colleagues. So then I came to know that he was a dog trainer. Uh, then I found it very interesting. So I thought maybe I can share uh, the, the process of his training his dogs uh, to my viewers and uh, maybe some of you who uh, who are interested in you know dogs and dog training uh, you know you can enjoy these videos so that is how I uh, met him uh, and uh, he uh, kindly accepted to you know show how he trains his dogs uh, so this Ivan he has two dogs of his own one is Pax which is eight year old and it's a German Shepherd and uh, the other dog is Pichu he's three years old and he's a Pomsky and there was one customer uh, dog which which was supposed to be trained and uh, that dog was also a eight year old uh, dog Milo and it was a silky terrier so I was uh, I had the opportunity to record all three dogs he he was training all three dogs for me and uh, we were recording it I had lots of fun recording uh, along with him and the dogs uh, so I'm going to share uh, all these videos bit by bit uh, in in the future weeks uh, forthcoming weeks but uh, first let me introduce him to you like I have I had a very short uh, conversation with him so this week enjoy the conversation with Ivan uh, see what he has to share with you all and then in the forthcoming weeks I'll be sharing the, the training of the dogs hi Ivan please introduce yourself hi my name is Ivan and I'm a canine dog trainer using positive based uh, methodology in training my dogs thanks for uh, having me here Ivan mm -hmm. thanks for making I mean allowing me to record this video sure. so like Oh, how long have you been uh, training dogs? I've been training dogs for a few years already. Okay, so what made you to come into this? So I have a passion from young. Mm. As a child, I always wanted to uh, keep dogs because okay. I love dogs a lot, my sister as well. Mm. But um, parents were not very open. They didn't really like dogs. They were afraid yeah. of dogs. Mm. So um, after that, you know, I was always like from since primary school, I already started fostering mm. other dogs for my neighbors and friends. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, for decades I've been working with dogs. So did you take any training, special training for this? Yes, I did go through uh, dog training. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So when a customer mm. brings a dog to you, okay, mm. so like what are the first steps? Like what do you do? So usually I would do it? info gathering mm. to find out the breed, the age of the dog oh, and okay. even the uh, gender and everything. Mm. If he has any like special diet restriction or what kind of concerns they would like to address. So okay. this is something that I will gather the information and then okay. after that I will start to just, um, you know, like introduce like the mythology mm. and approaches that I do work and train dogs mm. and usually uh, owners are mostly like lost about giving them the proper setup so I specialize in like doing teaching clients how to do a proper dog or puppy setup okay yeah so it includes like potty training mm. and then to eradicate any unwanted behavior such as barking excessively or jumping mm. on people or humping owners these are all not very good so okay. yeah these are concerns that they will address or even aggression as well or separation and uh, anxiety okay good what are the basic aspects in your training the training which you give dogs yeah so the it would cover basic obedience training mm. and then we also go into like different levels like basic intermediate advanced i used to also okay i'm actually professionally trained musically trained and i used to manage and run a music school including a social enterprise that uses music to reach out to people especially for a social cause 
and I also used to teach in international schools and right now as a dog trainer I actually apply what I have been trained in music to use music to work with dogs especially with like PTSD, separation anxiety yeah so that's how I can reach out to dogs so for training, when I train with dogs, I normally have um, three different aspects like people will come to me for basic obedience training which comprises of the basic, intermediate and advanced stage depending on how much they want to work with them and also, and also help um, clients who are really busy travelling overseas for business trip or vacation and so they will entrust their puppy, their, their fur friends, their furry friends at home to in my care yeah, so that's how I reach out. And the second one is sometimes like after basic obedience and they feel that their dog have a lot more potential or they just want to expand their learning stages, so then they will sign up with me for agility courses. And the third one is um, protection work, gut dogs. So this will be working with big dogs, Alsatians, okay. yeah, in the different breeds mm. of dog, yeah. Okay. So now what are your future plans or what, what have you in your mind? What so you I have already started a um, dog company, okay. a dog training school mm. and um, a smart boss. Okay. And I'll be smart boss. Smart boss. Boss. Yeah. Oh, okay. Smart so boss. I'll be focusing and reaching out to owners who have no idea and really seek help to address mm. their concerns with their puppy or their dog. Okay. Yeah. So you can focus more in like obedience training, potty training. I think they are very concerned like how they should properly set up. Uh -huh. So this is something that I can really teach them how to okay. use um, create training in mm -hmm. a more positive way rather than okay. punish. Okay. Really. So how can they ap approach you? Um, usually they can approach me through email or mm. mobile number. Yeah, okay. my social media. Okay. So when it comes to dog training, right? Uh, do they, do you expect the owners to come and approach you uh, to bring their dogs to you, or you can also go to them and go to their house and train their dogs? I can do both ways. So some of them are you know, traveling a lot and uh, okay. have to be there. Otherwise, they will send their dog to my site. Mm. For so either ways, you can do that. Boarding. Yeah, that's right. I can okay. Yes. In the forthcoming weeks, you can see how he trains his dogs.